And this holiday season. That was the rundown of the radio station. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Nothing on the radio. I personally don't like the radio. All these songs, I mean, I know all the songs, but I, it's not the music I listen to. <laughs> Um, but whatevs. Um, going in on my day off. Why? You know, the power of no. I don't know why I, you know, for, well, first of all, I never met a dollar I didn't like. <laughs> Um, and, you know, it's a good client. He comes in every two weeks. Spends a lot of money. Tips the front desk. You know, he's the only client that does that. And, um, going in on my day off. So, I was running late, and then he said, I'll be 145. I'm like... You know, it's my day off. I've got stuff to do. I've got, I've planned that I planned on doing. I mean, we just booked this appointment yesterday. So, um, I do have plans later tonight. My cousin is, um, well, she got married in San Diego. And, uh, so, uh, I love it when people get in front of me and then put their brakes on. It's like, why? Why? Um, uh, <clears throat> so anyways, what was I saying? I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, the client. So whatever, going in on my day off, which sucks. I mean, just breaks up my day you know I have a I take every other Saturday off because those are the weekends that I have my son I mean I have my son all week <laughs> um, I have sole custody he's, he's with me so um, it's not like I only see him on that day but but still, it's the only day that we all have off together because he's not in school. Oh, yeah, but we're going to my cousin's party tonight, so that should be fun. Um, it's only for a couple hours, though. And then... Um, and then... Uh, i got to pick up my man from work. And um, there's a game on tonight, so you guys will probably see my man on the Phoenix Suns. I don't know who they're playing, but he, uh, he's always on the court. He's got long, curly hair and mustache and a long, long beard. It's not a big, bushy beard. It's just a long, little skinny. He 
he's got the handlebars. He's always had the handlebars. 20 years ago, he had the handlebars. Um, and he doesn't really wear them out anymore because it's such a thing now. I hate when that happens. That's what happened with tattooing. All of a sudden, just everyone had tattoos and big tattoos. And it was just like, they're not even a part of the tattoo community. You know, there's a whole nother social community, or not social community, or, you know, it's just a whole nother lot, you know, a whole nother community of people out there, but that's starting to go away, people are starting, girls, you don't see a lot of girls, um, anymore, now it's kind of, it's going back towards just a specific stereotype, <laughs> um, so anyways, so, um, yeah, working out, and you know, I did a, today was rest day from Beast, and I did combat and Pio sweat, but I only did combat 30, with 30 minutes, it's like, ah, but it, combat, the cool thing about combat is that it goes by super fast, the next week I think I start the hour one, the 60, oh god, it's gonna be a killer, um, But, um, I did, um, but it just, it, that, that half hour just flies by. I mean, you're just constantly doing stuff, so. Um, so, and then, uh, yesterday I was on my Beast, Body Beast for Women page, and, um, and, a lot of the women were like, ugh, oh, you know, they're in the building phase, the first two phases of um, Body Beast, you're bulking and building. The first phase you're building, second phase you're bulking, and then the third phase you cut. And um, then the cutting phase, you feel tight and thin and tight. <laughs> And here in the building and bulking phase, you almost feel a little fluffy. You feel a little fluff. <laughs> um, and so I thought I was going crazy. I thought it was just me. I thought, like, is it just because, like, I'm imagining, like, you know, this HCG, um, font, you know, thinness feeling like Ricky had told me one day, she was like, I just, I don't feel that feathery light feeling. And I was like, it'll come back. It'll come back, you know? And it does and it will. Um, it's, it's just different. I mean, so, so I start beast and I'm like, by the end of this week, I'm kind of feeling a little, a little fluff of duff. And I'm up a little bit on the scale. I'm, I'm still only up two pounds, but I'm like, is this me? Is this like, am I going insane? Is this just like some residue from HCG, you know? And uh, so I get on Body Beast and somebody totally does this whole post about it. And all of the responses were just like, um, oh yeah, you know, and enjoy this little bit of fluff and blah, blah, blah. Because once you get into the cut, everyone's saying round three, that's your magic round. That's the round where you really um, see in the next 90 days. I'm really going to see what I've been doing all year. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Um, and it just made me think, you know, they're right. Like I'm doing different things to my body and now I'm doing, um, cardio and, and, um, you know, my meal plan, I'm kind of flexing on the meal plan. Uh, I'm eating most of my carbs and, um, anything that's carby or starchy, um, for my, for my post meal, like my, um, 
you know, gains, like that's when you want to eat your Chipotle bowl or that's when you want to go out for Chinese, like, you know, or get like a Chinese takeout, like, you know, you want to feed those gains in that little bit of window. Um, so a lot of people, they'll have like a nice dinner or whatever the night before and they'll save the leftovers for their post-workout meal. And I'm starting to get the hang of this, you know? So I was kind of feeling a little like, ah, I don't know, this whole fluffy feeling is weird, but now I know it's a real thing. <laughs> it's really real. <laughs> so um, I'm uber stoked about this next 90 days. I'm like really into it. And you know, like really the only days I'm going to be doing triple workouts are Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Because um, then Thursday I, I'm rest day from combat. Friday I'm rest day from Pio. Saturday is rest day from um, from Beast. And Sunday again I get another. I get two rest days um, in the 60 days um, of combat. So I'm only doing triple deckers on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. And I'm uber super stoked about it. So I'm I'm feeling I'm feeling good. I'm, I'm feeling really good. And I feel like I'm just going to cruise through the holidays. I'm going to stick to my workout plans. I'm going to stick to my eating plan as much as possible. Um, and then really January 1 is going to be my real, like my real, you know, going to get this nutrition down gonna get this nutrition down. I want it to be secondhand. I, you know, like I was saying yesterday, it's like, you know, the chick on my video, she's like, you know, fitness is a challenge every day. It challenges you, you know, and it's like, who are we if we're not challenged? You know, we're just, um, you know, just get into a day, a day by day, um, mundane way of life. And, I'm up for the challenge, at least for now. So, I'm here at work. I love you ladies. Have a great Saturday. Ciao.